your first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. Friday is here and we finally begin to talk about a warming trend and seasonable and unseasonably warm weather to stick around straight through the weekend. Nearly picture perfect, although there will be some clouds around from time to time. All of this changes though as we head into the middle of next week as a cold front drops into the Carolinas. We did wake up this morning though quite cold, unseasonably cold as we were back down in the 20s and low 30s. But that's going to change as we head through the next few days. We're going to get rid of that early morning chill. Waking up with more 40s and 50s in that seven day forecast with afternoon highs in the 60s and 70s as high pressure remains in control off of the east coast. It will gradually break down a little bit though as this cold front dives in from the northwest all the way into the southeast as we go through next week. By the middle of next week, it's pushing through the Carolinas, bringing in the chance for some showers, replacing that warmer air with a colder air behind it. So get ready for some big time changes as we go from Wednesday to Thursday of next week. But until then, I mentioned the warming trend. There you go. Tacking on a degree, two degrees, three degrees each and every afternoon from the previous. So that puts us all the way to the upper 60s to around 70 degrees by Sunday and the low 70s for the beginning of next week. You see what happens though when that front comes in on Wednesday. The clouds, the chance for showers brings our temperatures down just a little bit to the mid 60s and then we're struggling to get to 60 degrees by Friday. But your forecast today warmer than yesterday. Plenty of sunshine. Highs hitting 62 in Surfside, Myrtle Beach and North Myrtle Beach. 63 in Myrtle's Inlet. 64 in Sockets, Conway and Carolina Forest. Watch for a little breeze to come in off the ocean with that 54 degree ocean temperature. Certainly making the Grand Strand and cl closer to the beach areas a little bit cooler. With uh, plenty of sunshine inland again, though, we'll look for those highs into the mid 60s. Par for the course is 63. And we're within a degree or two on either side of that. So good looking afternoon forecast. Another cold night. We are just below those seasonal averages once again for the overnight lows with those upper 30s inland to low 40s along the Grand Strand. But at least we're not going to be waking up with those 20s and 30s to start off your Saturday. Granted, a little chilly to start, but the afternoon a few degrees warmer than today. Highs reaching the mid 60s with mostly sunny skies. Still a few clouds out there for your Sunday, even into Monday and Tuesday, but the temps are still rising into the upper 60s and low 70s, and those wake up numbers are going from the 20s and 30s we've been seeing into the 40s and 50s, waking up in the low 50s even for Tuesday and Wednesday. 30% chance of showers with the frontal passage on Wednesday, and we'll talk about those 50s coming in toward the end of next week returning that cooler air that colder air returning for the end of next week when we get a little bit closer and closer to the end of next week but let's enjoy this beautiful weekend we have coming our way highs will be in the upper 60s saturday and sunday granted inland areas especially a cold start once again to your saturday but 44 a little bit of a milder start for your sunday and again mid to upper 40s and low 50s as we head in through the end of the weekend and beginning of next week for those wake up temperatures your 2013 weather calendar is now available to order it's only 12 dollars if you order it and have it shipped to your home just make sure you go to carolinalive.com, click on that little tab there at the bottom right hand corner of the home screen and put in your order. And in just about a week, you'll actually also be able to come pick them up for $10. So make sure you head over to carolinalive.com and order your calendar today. And while you're there, you can always get your latest news and weather updates. Have yourself a fantastic Friday and a safe weekend.